So in this video, reviewing seven high paying side hustles you could start while working a nine to five job, how complete beginners are earning 100 to $700 a day with these brand new side hustles and how just one of these side hustles pulled in $346,000 in net commissions for me with no experience more with that after the intro. Hey guys, how's it going? Mike Vasile here. Welcome to this video. Before we actually begin, I remind you that Subtle Spots is open for this week's free workshop, where it's the fastest and easiest way to make money online. Sign up for it in the link below. We literally have a 62 year old woman go from zero to $160,000 in profit in 90 days, so check it out now. So one of the reasons why I wanted to go ahead and like just make money online was because I wanted freedom in my life, right? Like I saw my mom and my dad work nine, 10, 12, 16 hours a day at times, so just make sure that me and my sister would go ahead and for example, live a better life than they did when they were stuck in the Philippines as children. But what I saw is I saw what a nine to five job does. It made them fight. It made them always fight about the money. They never had enough money, no matter how much that they would work. They would have to sleep in different rooms because of the fact that they had different shifts. And before you know it, they almost were this close to divorcing because, not because of cheating, but because of money issues. And I knew for a fact earlier on that I did not want to be stuck in that nine to five job for the rest of my life. But guess what ended up happening? I started working a job that required eight hours a day of my life and little did I know, but I was literally slowly dying inside, right? And by the time I was done with that job, I had no energy, no motivation. I just wanted to sit down, watch Netflix, watch Vampire Diaries and just like relax, eat, go to bed because my life completely sucked. And I knew that that's what the biggest pain point is of trying to make money while working a job is you have no time or energy to actually focus on it, right? So what if there was actually a way though, where if all this did was find you at least a way to make your first hundred dollars a day so that you could work less at your job or to the point where you could actually make more money working part time than you do working full time at your job. Would you actually keep that job? And that was like my mindset. I was like, okay, if I could just make either a hundred dollars a day part time, or if I can make twice as much working part time on these side hustles than I do working full time on my job, then I would just focus all in on my side hustles and continue just to live my life, right? But again, if you're working a nine to five and you have no time, no money, no energy, no motivation, and no experience, this is what I do. This is literally what I would do to make $100 a day and scale that to $346,000 in net commissions for another side hustle that I started. So what was the first side hustle that I would start if I had no time, right? You have a nine to five job, you have no money, because for some reason, no matter how much you work your nine to five job, you always look at the number in the bank account, it always stays the same. Or if I had no experience, I would literally do exactly what I did back in the day to make my first hundred dollars a day in my spare time. It's very simple. I, in my spare time, would go and copy and paste pictures on Walmart and post it onto eBay. Look at this, $650, this exact same thing exists on eBay, but look at this, $499, this exact same thing exists on Walmart, right? Now here's how this side hustle works, right? If you have no experience whatsoever, the best way is arbitrage. But the, the old way that people talk about arbitrage is, oh, buy low, sell high, buy low, sell high. That's why people think, oh, doesn't it take money to make money? But this is inverted because instead of buying low first and then selling high, we sell high first and then we buy low on these free platforms, meaning it's virtually no risk and you don't need any experience. So again, in my spare time, I'll be like, okay, copy, paste, copy, paste, copy, paste, throw it up on Walmart, throw it up on eBay. Then when I would make a sale, guess what would happen? My phone would go cha-ching, cha-ching, cha-ching. And then it would say, oh, you just got PayPal, $650. Please ship it to this customer at this address. That's literally on my eBay app. The money is already in my account. I would then take that money, go over to Walmart, add to cart, buy it with the customer's money, and then ship it directly to the customer. I never, I never had the inventory in my garage or in my backyard or in my like basement. It literally always existed in Walmart. All I did was copy and paste the picture, throw it up on eBay, and when I would make a sale, I would take the money, buy it at a lower cost, ship it directly to the customer. Just like that, you can do that in your spare time and you're fine. Does that make sense? I got to that point where I was finally making $100 a day profit, okay? A second thing that you could do is do something similar but on Amazon. Why? Because Amazon is the number one e-commerce platform in the world. People come in here and they're like, oh, I want toilet paper, right? And they literally go in here because they don't want to leave their house because they're afraid of the world. There's so much things going on in the world right now. They don't want to leave. They just want to stay and be safe. They go ahead and buy toilet paper. Bam, toilet paper magically comes into my house, right? But you're probably wondering, well, Mike, I don't have any money to, to buy a bunch of toilet paper. I don't have money for inventory. I don't have the time to deal with logistics of shipping and handling. Well, here's the thing. You know, there's a possibility where if you type in Beagle gifts, right, for women, you saw my Beagle like in the beginning of this video, right? You will see that there's t-shirts 
that are up on here. Well, Mike, I don't know how to start a t-shirt business. Don't I need a bunch of t-shirts? Don't I need a bunch of colors? Don't I need a bunch of, you know, like different type of styles? Don't I need a bunch of sizes? Aren't t-shirt businesses hard? I don't have any money for inventory. Well, guys, with merch.amazon.com, you can start a t-shirt business for free on Amazon. But Mike, I'm not like a graphic designer. How would I go ahead and do this? Well, it's very simple. Notice how it says upload your artwork. You don't need to be an artist, right? Like you could go, literally go to Pinterest, type in something like if I wanted to sell cat t-shirts, right? I'll just type in cat t-shirt. You'll see all of these winning designs. Now, what I would do is just go for the ones that are just words. Right? Look at this, my le fitness level is cat. It means I'm lazy. I would then just go to Canva, go click on create, type in t-shirt, click on that. And just like that, they have a bunch of free templates that you could already go ahead and begin using, right? Like if I go ahead and click on this, t-shirt templates recently used, I could, look at this, I could do this. My fitness level is cat, it means I'm lazy. Again, I'm not doing this to the point where it's gonna make it pretty, but you could see that I can just go ahead and do this, go ahead and download this, upload it into merch.amazon.com and I have something very similar, for example, cats, right? Now you're probably wondering, well, what do I label it? Well, it's very simple. I would go ahead and just type in cat t-shirt. All these things that pop up, just put this in the title. The odds of you being found are a lot higher. Again, some of these designs can make you $100 a month, right? You can just do this in your spare time. Amazon does the shipping, the handling, the customer service. The third side us to do it is to just do it for yourself. I mean, Fanjoy did it with a bunch of creators. If you literally pull up any one of these creators, they started a t-shirt business for, for example, these influencers, right? And it's just simple words on like a hoodie, on a hat. But here's the thing, they do five to $10 million a year. You could simply do something very similar, like create a shop by sort, like literally it's very fast. It has all these templates. So you don't need, need any text avenues for it. Connect it with Printful. Printful has all these clothings, like men's clothing, like t-shirts, women's clothing, all over t-shirts, tank tops, kids clothing. They have a bunch of hats, right? They have a bunch of accessories, home and living, like canvas paints, flags, eco-friendly products right here. You have premium products right here, like phone cases, best sellers like these hats, right? At a very low cost and you can see that you could get it at a lower cost. So say your cost is $8. Say you say for you sell for 25, you sell 10, you get $169, right? So what people are doing is they're essentially doing this, creating their own websites and then going to, for example, places like YouTube where they find people like this girl who only has 12,000 subscribers. But when you see some of the content that she creates, she has like a million views for her video. You make a partnership with her, create a collection for her, a design for her and just have her wear a t-shirt like that in every video. Say, hey guys, if you wanna support the channel, buy it in the link below, and just connect it to your Shopify store and just split the profits with her, and you're good. That's a really good side hustle because you don't have to create the content, you don't have to show your face on camera, you just have to understand the business side hustle part on the side, right? And I love Shopify because Shopify was actually one of the ways that I literally went from zero to five grand in 30 days to 1.6 million that first year. So obviously, I'm not the smartest person in the world. If I can do it, what's stopping you? Now the fourth way that you could essentially do this is essentially get clients on Upwork. Oh, but Mike, I don't have any skills. The fastest and easiest skill that you can learn is Google Ads by going to skillshop.withgoogle.com and getting Google Ads certified for free. Look at this, you could go and learn marketing and sales, which most businesses will always need, meaning you'll always have a job. Google Ads certification, they'll literally have a full blown three to four five hour courses at times to teach you exactly how to get Google Ads certified. You could then create a free Upwork account and then you know do exactly that skill set that you learned, right? And look at this, $200 an hour. So if all you did was work one extra hour a day with clients, that's $200 a day already on the side while working a, a full-time job. So literally, as you can see, the best ways to start a side hustle if you have no time whatsoever is literally doing all these arbitrage methods like I've shown you or learning a high value skill set that people with money wanna spend money on. Like for example, for me, the people that run my Google ads, I pay them four grand a month and they only work an hour or two a day, right? And they have other clients. But all of you did was just get one client. That's still a good side hustle income on the side. Does that make sense? A fifth side hustle that you could go ahead and do is literally ClickBank. Why do I love ClickBank? It's because if I don't wanna do shipping and handling, if I don't wanna do customer service, if I don't wanna spend money in inventory, I can literally go to ClickBank and sign up for it for free and literally sell their health and fitness supplements where they'll do the shipping, the handling, the customer service, and they'll pay me most of my money, $153 commission, and they'll do all of the hard work, right? And the reason why I love ClickBank is it's one of the ways that I went from zero to eight grand 
in 30 days, guys. So you can see it works if you go ahead and actually follow the system and move it in a way that actually you know does really well. Now the sixth way to make money really fast, a side hustle, you see it all the time, is just blogging. Nerd Wallet is a big extent of what is actually possible with blogging, right? And you can see that they literally did $370 million last year. So in my mind is like, if I could, if they could do that, what's stopping me from blogging as a side hustle and just making a hundred dollars a day? That's why literally every, literally a lot of my time in my current side hustle right now with my existing business is just building my blog. I don't spend that much time on this. And you can see that we are doing the exact same thing, creating a bunch of blog articles that essentially rank, recommending products via affiliate marketing. The reason why I love affiliate marketing is we don't need to have our own product. We don't have to be the expert. We don't have to do the customer service. Affiliate marketing is a way that, you know, literally pulled in $346,000 net commissions. And essentially what it is, is I would just create content similar to NerdWallet. NerdWallet does best of, they do reviews, they do versus um, content, right? So what I do, is I'll literally come in here and I'll type in, if I'm in supplements, I'll do best supplements for, and I'll create content on this on either Google or YouTube. Same thing here, Be, uh, Bluehost versus another brand, right? You can see in one of my blog articles, or you'll see right here, Squarespace versus WordPress. So it's two comparisons of, for example, things. Or another one is review. If I just see a platform, I could review it, but I could also get an affiliate program for it. And if I want to sign up for any affiliate program, say I want to sign up for the Jump Rope affiliate program, I just sign up for that for free. They'll give me a special link, kind of like what I got on ClickBank. And if anyone goes and buys from that, I can literally get a good amount of commissions. Does that make sense? So I can literally do this for any product, guys. I did this literally for Jump Rope Transformation, right? And you can see I rank for the first page of that. 737,000 views, okay? So I can literally go ahead create a content either on my blog or on my YouTube channel, it doesn't matter where you go out and create the content, it's a really good side hustle, just creating content in general and getting in the habit of it, getting them to sign up for, for example, that jump rope, I would get a commission from it, right? But I think the seventh and best side hustle to start this year, and it's exactly what people in our community were doing in their spare time, someone like Dina, a stay-at-home mom, at 47 years old, went from zero to 30 grand a month in five to eight weeks in her spare time, as a busy mom of two, or Ilio as an immigrant, he had a nine to five job, or Greg, who did it at age 58 years old, or Chris at 24 years old, or literally Francisco from Chile, where the average income is $500 a month. Check out these podcasts, right? If you wanna see exactly what they did step by step by step with this brand new side hustle of this year, then make sure you sign up for this week's free workshop below. Check out this video in this podcast video, and I'll see you guys later. Woo!